guys, welcome back to my channel. We're having a great day. In today's video, I'm going to be filming my turkey haul. So, I recently went to Turkey for the week, just there at the start of April, and I did film the whole trip. Um, I don't know how well I managed to capture everything. I haven't got around to editing the vlogs yet, but you can expect to start seeing them next week. This video is going up slightly later. I usually upload every Wednesday, but this is Thursday you're seeing this. So, I can only apologise, but I got mixed up in the days. I got home late Sunday morning. Well, late Saturday night, early Sunday morning. Then, like, it was a bank holiday, so I was off the Monday. Then went back to work on the Tuesday, and it's kind of thrown me a bit. So I can only apologise that you're only seeing this now. But I hope you enjoy. So the first kind of subcategory we're going to dive into is stuff that I got on my resort. So I stayed at the Jiva Beach Resort which can I just say that place is where dreams are made of like it was beautiful we had a swim up room and <laughs> I'm honestly missing it so much the holiday blues have well and truly kicked in now and the fact that I'm talking about it again is just I wish I was back but anyway so we had to wear this band all week um so I just kept the band obviously we also had a little kind of wipe for like after food and stuff and save the fresh your soul this was just a spare one and i just kept it because i don't why not why not um and then a woman was walking around the resort and she was handing out kind of leaflets and stuff um and this is just all the about the water sports that they're on or available to do in boat trips and stuff um we did talk about me potentially doing the parasailing but i didn't uh, eventually get around to it to be honest um but yeah so that's just a leaflet again just kept hold of it also when we first got there there was obviously the transfer and stuff and they were handing out this leaf leaflet um just says welcome to turkey so obviously it kept that um and that was the name of our transfer if anybody was curious to know so so i just kept that now on our resort there was three or four shops literally built into the resort so obviously had a few brows like browsing about um and i did pick up a couple of things um firstly before we start actually i forgot to show you this we did get some slippers in our hotel room and <laughs> i don't know why they came home with us but they couldn't not come home with us so yeah <laughs> i mean i don't know i'm sure i'll find some use for them at some point i'll probably end up while wearing them but anyway so the first thing on our resort that we bought was this little fridge magnet and i'm 100 probably going to pronounce it wrong but we call it fetia or fetier not too sure but you get the gist and we just thought it was a good magnet so we picked that up um also this is a bit random but i kept a napkin <laughs> yeah i don't know why i showed that but anyway so that was that. The next thing that I got was this little keyring strap thing for bag, keys, anything really. It just says Christine Dior on it and it's just a little strap and I love it to be honest. I haven't put it on my car keys yet but yeah so that was that. The next thing I got is a bit huge to be honest so I'm not going to open it out but i'll insert a photo of it here for you so you can see it but it is this towel and it's just kind of got the design on it um and it does have kind of louis vuitton written on it well i suppose actually i kind of you kind of can see it i think <laughs> Um, yeah, I'll still insert a close up for it, so don't worry. But yeah, this and this still is really soft, you know, really soft. So I got this, and then the last thing purchased on resort, I believe, was these. And I couldn't find my red Polaroid sunglasses, so I ended up needing some new sunglasses. And I seen these, and <laughs> stunning. Um, so they're just. Chanel but yeah I will insert like a proper photo of them and stuff you'll not really get to see it because of the reflection of them but they are gorgeous and they just came in this little white protective sleeve 
and then it also came with the lens cleaner which if I can ever get out of this place so. yep and it just has a wee Chanel logo on it as well so there are my new sunglasses oh love it but I'll answer a close up photo um, or maybe a video actually to show you the legs as well on the sunglasses so they do need a clean to be fair but yeah they're really good and I love them so the next category I'm going to show you is the markets and stuff so we decided to take the well we tried to actually take the water taxi over to the markets but we couldn't do that because we were scheduled to get bad weather that day it ended up turning out really lovely but for some reason they cancelled the water boats or the water taxis um and we weren't able to do that so we just got a taxi straight to the market instead um and i seen a few things that i liked and i got them um so let's dive right into that the first thing that i picked up was these two pairs of shorts that i thought uh go on holiday again later in the year um and they would just do for pulling over like my bikini bottoms or whatever so i just picked up these it's just got a little gucci logo on it and then it just says gucci down the side as well um and the same on this side and i actually really like how these shorts sit on me and they're comfy as well um so i just got them and the other pair of shorts that i got were these ones same style but they were calvin klein and in purple instead of blue so again can't go wrong nothing too fancy just some throw over shorts that i just really like to look up next thing that i picked up was this gorgeous coral north face hoodie and this hoodie is honestly so warm like it was a great at night it got really really cold at night sometimes um and this was just an absolute lifesaver the best day for the markets apparently were tuesday and friday we were told and we headed over on a tuesday but because of the bad weather warning a lot of guys like never came never showed never like put their stalls up or whatever so it wasn't great we weren't overly impressed but we still went still experienced it and it's still something to say we've done but yeah so i got this hoodie um and it just has a little north face and side as well so i got that and then sticking to the hoodie theme i seen this hoodie and i really liked it I haven't worn it yet and um, it's still actually in the actual wrapping paper um but i'll show you it here and it's just a palm angels one i'll open it out actually now that we've, we've done this i'll open it out for you so this is what it looks like i really like the color of it and i really like the design on it as well so yeah and again this does feel like the same yeah like it's literally it's so soft i cannot explain it <laughs> i'm going to dread washing it because i know it's not going to be as soft as it is right now but um yeah so they were the two hoodies that i got um they are really nice and i can't wait to wear it so second last item that i picked up from the markets was a backpack and i really liked this backpack and again the last thing i need is another backpack but here we are and this is what we're dealing with but this just felt like really good quality to be honest um really nice again i just really liked it and why not it's really it's really nice and there's a lot of different compartments and stuff and i no 100% that I will be getting the use out of it because I use backpacks all the time for various different stuff um so yeah I got this the last thing that I picked up I couldn't not pick up it filled my mini Disney like sadness <laughs> I don't know it cheered me up when I seen it um but I just got this cute little bag it's a little tiny handbag and when I do return to Florida I shall be taking it with me um, or the next time I go to any Disney event, any Disney park at all, to be honest, I'll be taking this with me. And it's just a little gorgeous Michael Kors white 
Mickey Mouse handbag and it's tiny and it's cute and I love it. I'm not a handbag gal. I'm not. Never have been. But comes with a long strap as well so you can clip it and it comes like a crossbody. Um, but when I seen it, I just, I really liked it. Like, I couldn't not get it. So, I just dropped it. I just got this. And that was everything we got at the market. I have got bags everywhere. Like, I've got these bags. We have a bag from Google Fashion, which was obviously a shop we went into. I have this bag, but I have no idea where I bought from it. And then I've also got this bag. Which I will show you what I bought from this shop. I only bought one item from this shop. And it was actually still in the bag and that's how I know. But um, yeah, we ended up going here not intentionally. We were trying to get, we we're trying to find this like row of shops um, that we'd heard about. Like Google, Google Fashion, Dell Boys and Trendy. We like they were, they're all in the same area. And Cali's I believe it is. I could be saying that wrong and I apologise if I am. But we were trying to get to them. Couldn't find them for some reason. Ended up in the middle of nowhere. Probably in a city centre or something. Like the equivalent of a city centre. I'm not sure. But there were shops everywhere. And we were like, why not just browse whilst we're here. So we did. But anyway. Tried on this top. And it was lovely. I actually tried on the skirt as well. And if I can find the photo, if I still have it, I'll insert it here. If not, it basically was the same as this little skirt. But the diamonds were in the bottom. I didn't get the skirt because, to be honest... It didn't really do anything for me. It didn't really like it on. But the top was really nice. And I think it would go really cute with a pair of jeans. Or something. Maybe on my next holiday. Ooh. But yeah, I just really liked this top. So I got this top from the shop. <laughs> um. So that was that. But staying on the theme of the shops that I just mentioned. I went into Google Fashion. Google with two G's, believe it or not, even though the bag has one G, the Google shop actually has two G's. <laughs> anyway, and we, I think we did get more than this, but I think this is all that I got. Because I think I got, like, a present for someone, but I don't fully remember because, I don't know, it's, I've been home for a couple of days now and I'm sad about it, so. <laughs> but what I got is... Trainers! And I picked these up because, one, I love the colour, two, it kind of matched the jumper, like, oh, I would get away with that. But yeah, um, I picked up these trainers. I love them. They're really nice. I haven't worn them yet because I wanted to keep them clean for this video, <laughs> to be honest. Um, yeah, I, I, like I say, I do love them. And yeah, fun fact, actually I was in the shop but I had like sandals on and I didn't have socks um, and they actually took like a pair of socks off the shelf, like brand new socks and was like, there you go and they're actually like, they were like Tommy Hilfiger <laughs> socks. Um, I don't know where they are or I would show you but um, they were like blue and had like Tommy Hilfiger logos on them and he's like, you can keep the socks for free and I was like, <laughs> thanks. Um, but I thought that was quite fun. So yeah. Um, and he just gave me them basically to let me try on the trainers but yeah like I say I really like them I think they're really nice it's a lovely colour like I don't know if the camera's actually doing them justice to be quite honest but yeah so I got these from Google Fashion so the next thing that I got well the next items that I got were from a shop called Trendy that I have spoke about in the video um, the first thing that I picked up, which is actually, I actually really like and I have already washed it because I did wear it on my last day on holiday and it's come up, it's like, it's not even changed to be honest, like nothing's like smudged or anything like that, but I got a bikini and it's just this Chanel multi-logo print, um, so that's the bottoms of it and then the top is a bit tangled, but it's just this. Again, same print as the bottoms, but picked up that bikini and like I said, has already been washed and nothing actually happened to it. It's pretty much still as perfect as when I bought it. So that was the first thing I got. The next thing I got was, well, it came in this little brown bag and I got two different types of them, which I've got one of each in the bag because the other ones are on my shelf because obviously, as you know, 
I have one ear pierced and I only wear one earring, which is there's the clue. I just get two different types of earrings. I've actually got this one in today and I wore this one yesterday. Um, but I will insert like close-ups of what they look like, obviously on the ear. But this is oh, this is the first one that I've got. Oh, actually, there's the close-up there. And it's just little Dior, and I these caught my eyes straight away. I absolutely fell in love with them, to be honest. Um, so I got that, and then the next earrings again caught my eye and I really liked them again they've got a little mickey head on them and I couldn't say no to that but they are stunning and yeah I just really really like them so they were the two different earrings that I got and that was everything from trendy how do you think there we are finally on to the last category of this haul and as sad as the mother has come to an end but these are two items that i got in the airport um so the airport we flew from was dalaman airport and obviously we got the fridge magnet as you know but just i always kind of collect key rings when i go away and this was the key ring that i decided to pick up um not too sure how well you can read it but basically it just has like fetia and then it's like two different places in fetia i think or three two or three different places in fetia or fetia however you want to pronounce it but i just like the kind of style of it it's as if it's like bubbles little bubbles memory ball things i don't know but i like to i like to keyring so i got that keyring and the last thing that I got was <laughs> it is Easter Sunday after all when I go home and Easter Monday and I've never seen anything like this in my life and for those who know me know that Kinder is my favourite chocolate ever. <laughs> I can't explain how much I actually love this guy. Like actually his arms move like are we kidding on right now? Oh that's because I've already took the sale tape off him and he does crack open when I'm trying to pick the arm up. Ah. But basically it just has seven Kinder eggs inside um, and I will open it. And as you can see, I did have a Kinder egg already. Can't help myself, it was Easter. But yeah, so this is, I have named them Clint. So this is Clint the Kinder. Clint with a K, obviously. But um, yeah, seen them in the airport and there was only two of them to be fair. So this had to come home with me, of course. Of course it did. Of course it did. But I love it, it's literally like the size of my head. So he has a, his very own place on my shelf, of course. And with all that being shown guys, that is this video coming to an end now. I hope you enjoyed everything that I've shown you and you can let me know in the comments either if you've ever been to Turkey or your favourite thing that I got in this video. Don't forget to smash the thumbs up button, hit the subscribe button and turn on the wee bell notification so you don't miss any time that I upload and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.